country, we don't have any connection to the network. Or, or the, uh, in Japan, we can't use the, the mobile phone in train because in, uh, this conversation, we, we, we tend to make the conversation in loud voice so it will uh, bother the neighbors. Uh, in train in the, in the closed area. So, uh, such and such, it is a social and te technological problems. Uh, we, we didn't solve it, have, we, we haven't solved that yet. So, as a broadband network, anywhere, in other words, the ubiquitous network is not achieved perfectly in this year. So, uh, if, if we want the perfect cloud computing, we should have the perfect broadband network, ubiquitous network. So this is some requirement to uh, use the cloud computing technology. And, but uh, the, the discussion or the experience uh, now undergoing uh, despite all those uh, requirements or the, uh, some uh, problems. This is a list of the uh, famous cloud computing service mainly provided by the United States uh, companies, US companies uh, like the Amazon or the Google or the Force.com and the Windows Microsoft and the IBM, some Microsoft systems and Hewlett Packard. And all the major IT industries are going into the cloud computing uh, in a little bit different way. And the, the way uh, they, they are proposing the cloud computing is very, very different uh, between Google and Amazon or the IBM and some microsystems. So uh, the natural thinking is that how do we immigrate from Google to IBM if, I, if we want to, uh, if, we, if we feel some uh, necessity? Uh, for some uh, financial problem or something. Uh, the, the, currently, there's no, uh, no strategic or no efficient way to immigrate from one cloud computing service to other. So uh, there certainly exists the, the standardization issues here in this cloud computing. But uh, the the good things, uh, this is the official data from uh, MIC, Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communication of Japan. Uh, they have started up uh, some special uh, committee uh, or study group for cloud computing in uh, this July. And they are expecting the domestic market of cloud computing to be a two trillion yen by 2012. This is a very, very big number, and which will include the data center service and the server storage and infrastructure and network service and the shared outsourcing service and ASP SaaS application. And these four part of the cloud computing uh, elements uh, will be summed up to the two trillion yen market in uh, three years. Uh, from now. So uh, this is a very good story, but we have to uh, make uh, collaborate, have a collaboration, collaborative actions uh, by government, academic, and industry to uh, realize this uh, market size. So we are now discussing about these issues. So the next thing is the, uh, the National Electronic Post Office Box Plan. And, uh, well, uh, the Google is for the private uh, business or private sectors, all the people, uh, and the, uh, by the private company. And now the cloud computing service, most of the cloud, cloud computing services is uh, provided by the private companies, like I listed in the U.S. companies. Uh, Amazon or Google or Microsoft. And this is totally different. Uh, Japanese government is now planning to uh, develop a public cloud computing service. This is uh, the first example. Uh, the uh, National Electronic PO Box 
uh, P.O. box is, uh, I, I think in Taiwan you have the P.O. box in the post office. Um, well, um, this is a digital P.O. box. Uh, 